guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is gonna be an Abercrombie spring haul. I have a ton of new items that just released this season. And if you're new to my channel, my style is very neutral, minimal. I love a lot of basic pieces that you can layer in a lot of different ways. If you're into capsule wardrobes, I have a ton of items that will work for that. Lots of things that are just like basic necessities in your closet for spring and summer. So I'm gonna start off with the top that I'm wearing today. And while this is not a basic, this is probably the most like statement piece that I ended up purchasing. And I was actually a little bit hesitant on getting something that wasn't a basic, but I did realize as the weather gets warmer, if I'm not gonna be going out with a jacket, I do like to have some tops that are a little bit more formal. So I got this puff sleeve top and I love that it has like a sweetheart neckline and it is like super form fitting. And then also the sleeves are really soft and I just decluttered, I did a closet declutter recently where I got rid of a lot of my puff sleeve tops that I was wearing over the last couple of years. And some of them were super, super dramatic where they're almost costumey. So I was hesitant to get another one, but this is completely different from those. I feel like this is a little bit more of a modern take because the sleeve actually falls and it's not something that's like super puffy and sticks out. Like if you do put on a jacket, it's something that is a little bit more subtle. So that's why I really like this top. It also does come in a couple different colors. I might actually end up getting it in white as well because I really love the fit of it and the sweetheart neckline. I feel like it's super, super flattering too. So that is, the first top, it has a square back as well. So next up, I'm really liking this square neckline trend and I ended up getting a, well, two tank tops. They're the same, just in different colors, just a square basic tank. I feel like this is one of those items I was missing from my closet. I have the workout tanks and then I have more of like silky, more dressier tanks, but I definitely just needed a simple basic tank top. I feel like some of those basics get neglected sometimes in my closet, and then when I'm getting dressed, I'm like, if only I had this item, and this is gonna be the perfect fix to that problem in my closet. And a lot of times I do have body suits that are this same kind of neckline, but I realized that I don't always want to be wearing a bodysuit. So this is a great alternative if you don't want to wear a bodysuit, but you still want something very fitted and it's just long enough that you can tuck it into your pants, just like the top I'm wearing right now. It's not a bodysuit. You can tuck it into your pants and that way it kind of looks like a bodysuit too. So I got it in white and I also got it in black. I love that the fabric is a little thicker so it's not see-through. These are definitely great layering pieces for spring and summer. We just wear them with a pair of jeans, pair of trousers. Next up, I love like an oversized white button down, but sometimes a longer button down can look like a little bit overwhelming. Like it kind of takes over an outfit when I just want something a little bit more subtle. So I got this cropped button down. This is gonna be super cute with just like jeans and one of the tank tops I shared or also with shorts for the summer. Just throw it on with a pair of shorts, a tank top, a bodysuit. And then of course you could also wear it on its own, tucked into jeans or wear it with like a bralette underneath and have it kind of like open. So especially if you like the idea of a button down, but you don't want something that is like a little too bulky or feels like kind of like a blocky fit. This is a great alternative since it is cropped, but it still has that a little bit of an oversized fit to it. And then next I have a bodysuit. I have so many bodysuits that I've gotten over the last year from Abercrombie. I wanted one that had more of like a thinner strap to it because sometimes when I'm layering these with blazers, if they're too high neck and there's too much like fabric by the neckline, it can feel like very like blocky. So I ended up with this one with a square neckline and just a spaghetti strap, just a simple basic bodysuit I'll end up wearing like several times throughout a week this spring and summer. So next up, this is probably my favorite item I'm gonna be sharing today. These are wide leg black trousers. And this is something that was definitely missing from my wardrobe. There's so many times where I wanna wear something a little bit dressier than jeans. I don't wanna wear a leather pant. Sometimes they're just like a little too form fitting. So this is perfect. It has such a comfortable fit. It basically feels like sweatpants. And because it's a wide leg, it doesn't feel so much like business wear or work wear. I love that it has the wide leg because you can definitely wear it a bit more casual. You can definitely dress it up 
wear it with heels and a blazer too but you can definitely wear it with sneakers so i love this for like a night out definitely with some of the different tops that i showed you could just pair it with a bodysuit as well and a lot of jewelry so these pants are super super necessary to me for spring and summer and then next up i also wanted to get a new black blazer i have one in my closet already i have one from zara but it's just so bulky it feels very heavy it's like a very much a winter blazer this one's a lot more lightweight it's also not too expensive compared to some other high-end blazers but i love that it's more of a lightweight feel you can definitely just wear it with jeans it doesn't feel too structured where it's going to look off with jeans you can wear it with the trouser i just shared any other kind of trouser even like shorts for the summer and like knee-high boots or booties as well this is an overall go-to lightweight blazer that is still oversized but not super boxy or anything it still has like a nice silhouette to it all right and then lastly these are sold as separates but i wanted to get the set because i just thought it looked so cute together so i love that you can get a lot of different outfits out of both of these pieces like this just with a pair of jeans this with like some of the, the black top or one of the white tops that I shared as well. But I love this set because it's such a cute resort vacation kind of style. I would wear this just like around town. I would wear this for a night out with heels and just like a dressier handbag as well. It also is available in black. I was debating between the black one and the white set. But I thought that the white was like a little bit more unique compared to just a matching black set. And it definitely just looks super cute for like resorts or vacation wear. I do not have any vacation plans yet. But once I do, this will be what I'm wearing. Um, I love this top. It has a little color to it. I love the neckline of this. It's not like super buttoned up. And it is cropped, but it doesn't show too much skin. And then we have the pants that go with it. These are super, super comfortable. They feel like a sweatpant. I love that they're not see-through, so they are a little bit thicker. They are a linen blend, but they do feel a little bit softer and thicker than a normal linen pant. I do have like a linen white pant that I got from Abercrombie last summer. And these are just like a little bit more of a casual wear. I would also wear these with sneakers and like this black tank top, the white pants, some black sneakers, a black crossbody bag. Super cute. You can mix these up in a million different ways. That's why I wanted to get a bunch of like neutral basics for spring and summer. But those are all of the new items I picked up from Abercrombie this spring. I do also have a lot of jean favorites from Abercrombie. So I'll link those below, including the ones I'm wearing. These are the 90s high rise straight jean, I believe. All those words are the combination of the name I love these I love their dad jeans and their mom jeans and their flare jeans so I will link all of those below and I'll link my previous Abercrombie hauls below as well and if you guys like this video make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I'll talk to you guys soon in my next video thank you so much for watching bye